Well, I'm looking pleased with reason. I think I've just been given a present. Oh, by whom? Taplo. Taplo, that's fantastic. Hey. So, what was the present? Well, it's a, uh, a translation of the Agamemnon by, uh, by Robert Browning. Let me see. Oh, he's inscribed it. What does it mean? Darling, <laughs> what is it saying? Uh, it's, uh, it's all Greek to me. <laughs> Mr. Gilbert, can you enlighten us, please? Uh, how marvellous. It's a uh, hexameter. Uh, oh, Theos, Prathora, <laughs> Yes, but what does it Kathora. mean? Well, I'm not familiar with the, the Browning version, but uh, roughly uh, it translates as God from afar looks graciously upon a gentle master. Oh, how sweet! Yeah, and very apt. Can't imagine a boy giving me a present. <laughs> Nor me. It's a very wonderful thing to do, don't you think? Yes, yes, yes mm. very much so, yeah. He, he, he bought it with his own pocket money. What was the inscription again? God from afar looks graciously upon a kind master. Well, perhaps not kind master, but gentle master. Yes, I agree uh, with Mr. Gilbert. I think gentle is a better translation. Oh, all right. Yeah. It's a lovely gift. I'd rather have this present than anything else I could think of. Cunning little brat. Why cunning, Laura? Andrew, you don't have any wine. Can I give you some champagne? Why cunning, Laura? Because... <sighs> Yesterday, I saw Taplow doing an impersonation of you for Frank. Obviously, he was afraid that I would tell you and that you would put him on Cromwell's or stop his switch to Frank's form or some other Hitlerian torture. The book is clearly a, an insurance policy, a sweetener, a bribe. <laughs>